Today, we're playing Need for Speed Heat. Welcome back. It's been a few days since we made a previous video on this. Of course, we're doing some stupid modifications to the game again. I popped it down. The key night of you will notice that the wheels are slightly popping out of this car. That's right. That's exactly the starting point for today's video. The RPM. And I thought we'd make the car wider just to account for that situation. Now, we're going to do a quick bit of modificationism to this car because it needs it. It needs to look spicy. It's a Sylvia. It needs to be modified to absolute hellfire. I do like all of them. But I think I'm going to go with this one. We're going for the full round kit of this except the splitter because, of course... This split doesn't have a bloody splitter, does it? So far, we've done some crazy horsepower. So far, we've done some crazy torque. Some ridiculous builds of swapping in things and playing with bits. Basically, we've had a, a whale of a time, I would say. But I've decided now that I want to cheat, cheat, step back a little bit. I'm not giving this car too much more power. So realistically, in terms of power, all we've done is given this thing a little bit more than... I'm, I'm going sh to show you. Power-wise, we're looking at 832 horsepower. It's not a lot. It's not a little. Ah, you see, the size or the amount doesn't matter. It's what to do with it. Oh my god, I didn't even know it had the sleepy lids with the colored lids at the same time. That's beautiful. Go for the blacked out look. That looks beautiful. I love this car. I definitely would own one. I definitely would. But I have a Skyline, so you know. Oh, <laughs> big Silvio. We're going to need that downforce. That's going to be required. We're going to make the lights tinted. I'm hoping there's going to be some LED lights or something, because that's usually the case with these Japanese machines. Yes. I want to burn my bumper. I do. Yep. It's exactly what I want to happen on my very expensive modifications whip. And we did play. Of course, popping the wheels out slightly, I think, is a very subtle, nice way to... If I could do this in the game, I would. It looks really, really aggressive. I don't know. It's, it, it, it's grown on me. The non-perfect fitment. It's just a bit stupid, you know? Right. Let's get this exhaust tuned, and then we're going to pop up. You may have heard what we're going to be doing right there. <laughs> it's still going down. <laughs> oh, right, let's just leave it at that. So we're very lucky that I decided to up the torque of this to be complainers. Well. I'll demonstrate it. Now, if I decide to accelerate... <laughs> it also takes a while for it to spin back around. Let me, let me show you what the speedo does, okay? Because it's kind of ridiculous. If I hold the handbrake and then... <laughs> Look at it just go, spin, 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 and then rev its way down. This is ridiculous, yes. We're just going to spin for ages. I have put it on manual. Just so I can have a little bit more control. We're going to wheel spin the whole way. Okay, we might actually have to put drag tires on this, to be honest with you. Uh, let's go for some live tuning quickly. Do the do the basics. But the cool thing is, if you put it in a high gear, you can basically make it like an electric car. Are you ready? Listen. It's funny because it actually makes the same noises. It, it just makes an electronic whine. Oh, it's going. We're making a bit of noise. Combustion, baby. Combustion. Oh. I have to say, it's a very weird feeling. Because if you accelerate really aggressively and then let off, you still have torque for ages. You still have a lot of torque. I'm now in second gear and it's flying a bit. Look at the speed. <laughs> It feels like it could just keep going and going. But of course, unfortunately, there's a hard speed limiter in this game. And hopefully at some point someone can crack that, figure it out. But it does seem that that is what we're going to be stuck to. For the foreseeable. But it's still trying to accelerate. <laughs> you can see it wants to do more. I'm going to hope that we've got some drag tires to throw. Because if we throw some drag tires, they'll make it all the best. Oh, yes. There we go. What are we actually doing? Top speed. This is 300 miles an hour. Which is, of course, not possible, to be completely honest with you. But we do have a lot more control now. We can hold the speeds. We're actually... I think we're going faster. I think we're going faster than what it's actually saying. Because I think there's a hard limit. But I think we're passing it. I can't turn. <laughs> Let's accelerate. Holy crap. We're passing the speed record. <laughs> I think we just went 270 plus. We do need to repair. I think I may have just... I think I've cracked it. I think I've solved. You need 69,000 RPM. That's why we're stuck at below 300 on most day-to-day -day cars. We need more RPM. So the problem's always been with this game that it's really difficult to find a place to actually go properly straight. But let's have a look. Okay. For some reason... Wait, second gear. That went a little bit faster. Wait, first gear. First gear is the speed, baby. Holy... Poo -poo. First gear is the key. So what I'm going to try and do, I'm going to get up on this highway up here. 
I think this is probably the best way to go. I hold the RPM, so I just slide everywhere. This is kind of ridiculous. <laughs> come on, turn! Here we go. Faster! Oh, come on! We went faster, come on! Come on! Keep going! 260 is all I could bloody get! The only issue is there's just not enough road. That's the problem, holy crap. It just holds it sometimes, it just... <laughs> Don't crash! We're okay, we're okay. Speed, baby! Get that boost going. Oh! Uh, yes, yeah, so this is basically how I predicted this video to go. But only on a six speed. If we drop to a five speed, the gears are going to be longer, right? That's that's my thinking right now. If we go also to the auxiliary and we pump it, and we don't have the elite parts. I'm, I'm such a noob on the PC version. But if we go for nitrous power, is that going to help as well? I don't know. Onto the highway. Begin a nice, easy pace. I do also love the fact that we've got blue neons and blue flames on this. This is the blue mobile. The blue b b b blue mobile. Don't rest. Gets that speed, baby. Come on. Still climbing, still climbing, still climbing. 270, come on. 270. I saw a 270. I think we need 100,000 RPM. Hmm. 100,000 RPM. Almost double the torque multiplier we already had and almost under half the weight. All of this should add up to an incredible machine. Holy crap, this is going to be insane. So let's just uh, equip this item, giving us 1,600. But that ain't the stat that matters. What matters is what we get performance-wise out of it. I'm so ready to see this. Here we go. <laughs> it's just going to spin. Okay. That's real. Did Make sure we still got drag tires on, because that was a little bit slidey. We do. See, I do all these upgrades to the performance, and I never touch the brakes. I should probably do that sometime, from time to time. Let's go. Let's get it. Oh, I can't control it. I can't control it. It's too fast. She's too aggressive. Oh. This is just a handful. I can't, I can't deal with it. The RPM stay for so long because it has to cycle back down again. It has to calm down. It's it's too much. It just it can't just stop. You can't just turn off the tap. Under a thousand RPM. If you didn't realize, it's a bit nonsensical. <laughs> Can we not turn off the traffic? Because <laughs> this is real. Speed. You know what? We need a race along here. Now, of course, someone will definitely do a poo poo on my head. If I don't do a race, we've got to do a race. We've got to demonstrate that this is impractical. No car should ever rev. This high, I need to bloody get into high gear. <laughs> the speed. God damn it. It's too much. It's too Like the last race we did. I think that we did a race with the, was it with the Huracan. We put way too much power in the Huracan and it wouldn't drive properly. Yeah, this is the same case again. Of course, unless you just drive like... You could just drive like a granny console. If you drive like a granny console, I say like a granny. Boost, baby! I just put... I tap the NOS and it doesn't even give me a high sense of speed. I tap the NOS and we're at 200. That is ridiculous. I just stay in sixth gear. That's the practical way to use it. If you're going to, for some reason, build a 100,000 RPM automobile, this is the way to do it. This is... It feels really slow. I do feel that we chose a very mixed bag of a car. This car is very good at many different things. But I'd say more so thought about as a street or drift vehicle. I think we need to use something hypercar-esque or supercar-esque when we do this. Because the speed is, is very... This is teaching me to control it though. At the same time, I could... We're going we're gonna to give it another go at top speed. I promise you. I will try and break 300 miles an hour. But this is teaching me to drive it a little bit better. Let's go down a gear now. Increase the difficulty. Every time you go down it... Ah! I'm correcting it. I'm correcting it. Now we've made a drift machine. Fifth gear is a drift car. It's somewhat controllable. We're just going to mungie down the road. Please, I need to survive. There's a repair just down the... You see, listen. This, this could have gone so... I don't understand. Surely... This oval track is going to be kind to us. Let's just put it in seventh gear. Eighth gear. Completely forgot about that. Oh, God. Oh, God. You see, now this is the challenge. They're going so slow. <laughs> I, I can't believe how slow they're going. They are also not the highest level available because we are, again, on my lower end PC save game. But we are still in seventh place. Sixth place. 
We just wheel spin. This is ridiculous. I need to... Right, stick with my own rule. My own rule was to stay in the higher gear possible. Why have I forgotten this rule? I'm not so sure. Let's just do a nice little... Oh, drive. Here we go. Very, very clean. Very nice. Look at that. Perfect. It holds 250 better than a Bugatti. A Bugatti would struggle at this point. You're all you youngins out there, you're like, ah, Bugatti, Bugatti, the best thing ever. No! It's me, Sylvia. Don't tap the wall, though, because you will lose a lot of speed. <laughs> this is just stupid. It doesn't go any faster in this gear. Down to fifth. I mean, seventh. I mean, yeah, fifth. Let's do fifth. Oh, yeah, we got we got some more speed building. Hold in first. Hold in first. You're just spinning. Woo! Please, please, please. I need to finish this event. I need to finish at least one. I can't stop it jumping. Please, I'm on the ground. Don't reset me. There we go. I'm fine. I'm fine. Go! Ooh! I finished! And the best way to demonstrate how ridiculous this actually is, if I accelerate and let go, it's going to keep pulling. Ah! Honestly, you just got to have a lucky run. Oh! 280. I saw 280. Please tell me. Please confirm. Please confirm. Oh! Please, 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 please. 280, 281, 283. <gasps> 290, 290. Come on, hit 300. No, the road's not long enough. This is the best place I've found. It's a... Downhill. That should be perfect. No issues. Keep the wheel spin to a minimum. Keep it down low. Too much traffic. Whatever. Go for it. He's going for it. Come on, give me 290. Where's 290? There's 290. Get back on the road. Please, 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 please. That was three off. This is how it keeps ending. I've done as much as I can. We we, we were stuck at the barrier of about 290-ish miles an hour. But we figured out that the barrier is breakable. And that's, that's good news, right? Of course, I want to explore this more. More shall be done, my friends. So be sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you want to see me break the barrier 300 miles an hour because we will be doing that in a supercar. So let me know what supercar we should use to try and break that barrier. Maybe it makes sense to use the Regera. We'll see. Until next time, my friends. Peace.